everybody Dizzy Nails and Beauty here with a how to prepare your nails for enhancements first of all uh, you're going to sanitize your hands make sure they're fully sanitized and then come in with some nail clippers and clip your nails as far down as you can not too far you don't want to break that hypernychium seal unfortunately for me I do actually have a very high hypernychium due to me wiring enhancements a lot uh, once we've done that we're going to come in with a cuticle pusher and push down any dead skin that's on the nail plate and doing this nice and slowly and not scraping or digging into the nail once we've done that we're going to get the wand and flip it over and use the hook to hook off any of the excess dead skin I am doing this form in real time but the rest will be sped up just for your convenience that you don't want to say you're watching the same thing Once you're happy with that, dust off any excess dust. Come in with some cuticle nippers to remove any of the excess dead skin. Do not remove any live skin because your nails will bleed. Well, the skin will bleed, not the actual nail. Um, and just be very careful. Like when I first started, I was terrified of doing this and I did catch myself a few times and occasionally I still do. We come in with an e-file and I'm using a diamond bit which is very delicate. It isn't a rough one at all and we're literally going to go over the nail plate to remove any of the excess dead skin that the uh, cuticle pusher has missed. I would not recommend doing an e using an e-file unless you've done an e-file course because they can be very dangerous. But as you can see, it does actually remove a lot more than the cuticle pusher, so it is worthwhile doing a training course in it. Um, and you don't actually have to have such an expensive e-file, though I have had cheaper ones and I fully recommend getting the more expensive because the vibrations is a lot less. Um, once I've done it one way, I then put the uh, e-file in reverse to change the rotation of the drill bit and I then go down my right hand side just because it really does get more off there when you do rotate it. I learned this off somebody off YouTube but I couldn't tell you who. I then come in with an even finer bit, a ball bit and I'm just going to go over the dead skin and going to remove and smooth out any of the excess there. Again, once we've done it going all the different ways, I also then put it actually in the reverse rotation on the file to go around the right hand side. Once we've done that, we're then going to come in with a normal nail file or an emery board and we're going to um, give the nails a file, making sure we're just going in one direction. Once we're happy with that, we're then going to go over the nail plate because this is important for any of the enhancements you're using to adhere to. It needs a grip on there. Once you're happy with that, we're then going to give it really good dusting. And then I'm going to come in with some alcohol on my brush to really get rid of any extra debris. And then that's my nails done and prepped guys. So thanks for watching and please comment, subscribe and I hope this helped you. And see you soon. Bye.